the government is equally focused on a more comprehensive GDP, that is, governance, development, and performance. Governance, development, performance. Aid over Bhitti Kore on a Kibishi has provided for car Krishna Kurache, Unari. People centric and prompt trust based administration with citizen first and minimum government maximum governance approach. Rushashan Abishi, Sharkar Kam, Rutum Hutsa Nagurik, Ekai Sharkar in all sectors. There is no sector stability, including in the Ekshakar Kurache. Investments are robust. The economy is doing well. Authority People are living better and earning better, with greater, even greater aspirations for future. Average real income of the people has increased by 50 percent. Inflation is moderate. Mudra spiti onik kai komiye phala shampa poche. Equipped and enabled to pursue their aspirations. Manush there is effective and timely delivery of programs and of large projects. Aspiration is to economic management. The multi-pronged economic management over the past 10 years has complemented people-centric, inclusive development. Following are some of the major elements. One, all forms of infrastructure, physical, digital or social are being built in record time. All, number two, all parts of the country are becoming active participants in economic growth. Economic number growth three, three, digital public infrastructure, a new factor of production as it in the 21st century is instrumental in formalization of the economy. Number four, goods and services tax has enabled one nation, one market, one tax. Tax reforms have at led to deepening and widening of tax bazaar, base. Number tax. five, e strengthening of the financial sector has helped in making savings, credit unnane. and investments more efficient. Number six, gift, Rain IFSC e and the Unified Rain. Regulatory Authority, IFSCA, are creating a robust gateway for global capital, are creating a robust gateway for global capital and financial services for the economy. Number seven, proactive inflation management has helped keep inflation within the policy band. Now the global context on the speaker, manushe. geopolitically, global affairs are becoming more complex and challenging with wars and conflicts. Globalization is being redefined with reshoring and friendshoring, disruption and fragmentation of supply chains and competition for critical minerals and technologies. A new world order is emerging after the COVID pandemic. COVID pandemic India assumed the G20 presidency during very difficult times for the world. The global economy was going through high inflation, high interest rates, low growth, very high public debt, low trade growth and climate change. The pandemic has led to a crisis of food, fertilizer, fuel and finances for the world, while India successfully navigated its way. The country showed the way Egi forward che, ke, and built consensus kore. on solutions for those global problems. The recently announced India Middle East Europe Economic Corridor is a strategic and economic game changer for India and others. In the Not words of Honorable Prime Minister, the corridor, and I quote, will become the basis of world trade for hundreds of years to come Urdhugami. and history will remember that this corridor was initiated on Indian soil." Unquote. Wish, vision for Vikasit Bharat. Vikasit Our Bharat vision, vision for Vikasit Bharat is that of prosperous Bharat in harmony with nature 
with modern infrastructure and providing opportunities for all citizens and all regions to reach their potential. With the next five years will be years of unprecedented development and golden moments to realize the dream of developed India by 2047. The trinity of demography, democracy and diversity backed by Sabka Prayas has the potential to fulfill aspirations of every Indian. As Honorable Prime Minister in his Independence Day address to the nation mentioned, I quote, there is no dearth of opportunities, as many opportunities as we want. The country is capable of creating more opportunities. Sky is the limit. Unquote. Strategy for Amritsar. Our government will adopt economic policies that foster and sustain growth facilitate inclusive and sustainable development, improve productivity, create opportunities for all, help them enhance their capabilities and contribute to generation of resources to power investments and fulfill aspirations. Guided by the principle, reform, perform and transform, the government will take up next generation reforms and build consensus with the states and stakeholders for effective implementation. It is an important policy priority for our government to ensure timely and adequate finances, relevant technologies, and appropriate training for the micro, small, and medium enterprises, MSMEs, to grow and also compete Global, orienting the regulatory environment to facilitate the growth will be an important element of this policy mix. Aligning with the Panchamrit goals, our government will facilitate sustaining high and more resource efficient economic growth. This will work towards energy security in terms of availability, accessibility and affordability. 